What's going on everybody? Tyler and Nori here with Team Zombillies in the ScareFactor.com. We are here at Abattoir Haunted Attraction here in Vincennes, Indiana. This is a second year hunt. Uh, we were able to come back and or we were able to see them last year for the first year which was really cool so now we're really excited to see uh, some of the changes and stuff that they've made for this year but kind of a quaint little building here right on the uh, the main drag here in Vincennes. Pretty cool that they got uh, like uh, some projections and different things out by the road uh, here out by I'm gonna spin you around here they've uh, got a couple of tents set up here for it is drizzling outside a little bit so that's nice of them uh, always got super friendly people here at the uh, the ticket booth and all this kind of thing uh, they got a couple portable restrooms uh, last year they had some pretty creative ideas with uh, their special effects and different things thinking outside the box uh, it's not a real long haul as you saw it's kind of a little bit of a small building but there's already people running around the building so we're going to uh, get you guys some pictures and videos here and go ahead and jump right in and see what's new for Abattoir for 2021. He can't do it. He's walking out. He's running away. Ran into this weird looking clown guy. Let me get my mask on. He's got his mask on. <laughs> Name's Billy Bonzo. People are scared of clowns. I don't know why. I can't imagine why they. Uh oh. That's his real face. That's his real face, folks. Yeah, I keep telling these people. I'm not a clown, I'm a murderer. Yeah, there's a difference. There's a difference. <laughs> He's got his band inside there, he did last year. We ain't been through I'm not yet. I'm doing some like balloon animals out here. Right? Nope. I can see that he's still got some hair on the end of the pin there. Why? Right. That's yeah. He's, he's, I don't he's know where used this it came a time from. or two. I don't know. He's like how when he found it, right? It's <laughs> an old bowling pin someone tied to a stick. <laughs> they won't let me in here. Or they try to make me come in here. I don't know. You said they keep you telling me there's a court order against me. I can't come in here. Can't go in? And then, like, sometimes the, the doctor, I don't think he's a real doctor, but he comes doctor. out and he's like, Bonzo, go to your room. And then, then people come in. He, they let these people in here and they are screaming, right. like, terrified. And I'm like, what am I going to do in my room? Like, I. You know, I try to read my, my fantasy novels, right? And my romance <laughs> novels, but these guys come in there and, <laughs> and they're like, screaming. You can't get a word in it, guys. And then they right? scream at me. I, I try to talk to these nice people who come to this weird place, and they scream at me. And, and somehow blood ends up on the end of your bow yes. and yeah. I don't know how it happens. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it's hard to get off. <laughs> right? <laughs> like a tide stick. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we just got out of Avatar back out here in the parking lot. It dumps you out back here on the other end of the corner. We almost got swished. We almost and got cut. swished. And cut. And a lot of other things. There's a lot of cool stuff going on oh, in no. there. So, one of the most. <laughs> they've got some really unique stuff going on. We can't on. tell you We like can't everything. tell you all of it, but they have. we got to tell you some teasers. They have a hallway where you might get smashed. I think we said that already, but you might actually get smashed if you don't get out of the way fast enough. Um, and somebody has because there's a big bloody I walked person into the, on the, wall. the other end of the hallway and I went, it looks like somebody literally ran into the wall and died. Uh-huh. And now we know why. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a chainsaw hallway where um, if you're not watching, you might get cut up by a chainsaw. Um, there's three different routes that you can take through one particular spot so you can go doctor, through several different times and probably not get the same show the, the doctor, doctor will tr choose which type of treatment you uh -huh. need. yes tyler That's and i needed is. all three treatments we, needed, yeah, we had to see all three um <laughs> so very cool there uh yeah um every time they've they actually would focus. got some really high-end like animatronics and stuff in there too like not uh -huh. the greatest scene detail and stuff but for what they've got they've 
there's some really good scares in there. Like there this are. year compared to last year, especially they cut down on a lot of your sight line and stuff. So there's a lot more zigzagging yeah. around. Yeah, last year the, some of the rooms were like huge. Yeah. And it was like hard for people for actors to hide in there and. And you'd get like the 14 year old girls just blasting right through there, and they wouldn't even see the scare. So they mm -hmm. they made change it change that up a little bit to where you have to navigate a lot more mm -hmm. now, which probably lengthened. The attraction. Oh, it's got to be guess. longer. It's got to be. Yeah. Longer. I haven't checked the time yet, but we'll. But they have, it they, the have um, they have a lot of surprises here. Like I don't know mm -hmm. how to describe this one, but it's a lot of fun. It took us two and a half hours to get here. It's totally worth two and a half hour drive. Oh yeah, for sure. Everywhere we looked, like there was this really cool looking skeleton in there, just peeking around the corner. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and when I got up to it, I had to look at it because mm -hmm. I'm like, is that thing real? It doesn't really really look real. And as like, soon as I looked at it, something come out. Come out from underneath something mm -hmm. and it was like the a lot of good distractions distraction yes, yes very good they, so yeah. many good distractions get some big meat monsters in there and they're they all got, different too because a lot of times different. we see like we'll see a distraction or a drop panel distraction drop panel or something else and those are effective mm -hmm. but they don't do that here i don't think i saw a clown in there either just well there's the one. Oh yeah there's mm -hmm. one in the orange suit the, billy billy yeah we saw him in there mm -hmm. But yeah, there's not a lot of clowns, so I mean, it's cool to see that originality. A lot of haunts kind of revert to clowns and use that to... I mean, they have enough in there to where if you're afraid of them, yeah. that's what they do. But they've got, they've basically got, it really is like a, a building of your nightmares because they've got werewolves, mm -hmm. they've got serial killers, they've got electrocutioners. Mm -hmm. And they've got all kinds of stuff that some really like, look like their faces are peeling off. Dead bodies. Some really good masks. We were in talking there. to a lady that refused to go in because she said she walked in the front door, and all the dead bodies hanging scared her, so she couldn't even make it through those. Yeah, yeah. There's oh. we saw somebody having a panic attack out there after mm -hmm. just for a couple of days. It's, it's a pretty, pretty good haunt. Come out here to Avatar. Uh, I forgot to mention that at the beginning of the video. Avatar is like French for slaughterhouse or something like that. So. They have definitely figured out multiple ways to slaughter people. Yes, yes they have, and they're actively doing it down here at the at the finale. So yeah, <laughs> come out. <coughs> excuse me, come out here and check out Abattoir, Vincennes, Indiana. Tell them the scare factor sent you. We are headed to the next haunt. Until then, be scary.